Another oh, dude, we got so trolled. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to our Tunic Let's Play series. We are back here again in this episode, and we are ready to take down this gauntlet. So we are deep underneath the cathedral right now, and we're kind of a, in a battle of attrition. Uh, when we go downstairs, we've got an interesting set of... Uh, groups of enemies that we need to fight and take down and we need to figure out the most effective tactics to uh, do so so that we can efficiently or efficiently make it through all these waves of enemies and uh, be able to survive to the end so we got to our second to last wave last time we had some lizard men remaining in the end and uh, it wasn't too bad but uh, the last guy ended up getting us at the very end. He was kind of an annoying one to deal with, and it just... I cracked. Cracked into the pressure, man. <sighs> so, uh, yeah. Uh, what I think I want to do is do some of the harder ones first, and personally for me, I think... I think the Lizardmen were probably one of the hardest ones. So I think we're going to start with those, get them out of the way, and then uh, go from there. So we're also running uh, this thing, which turns all of our healing... our health... our magic potions into mana potions our health potions turn into mana potions so we can actually use this to restore that so it allows us to use our gadgets a lot more um so it's very handy it is very handy indeed and uh we're gonna keep using that for the time being and uh yeah let's go ahead and start on these guys and we're gonna put on this actually so that we can deal with those annoying shield guys there we go so with these you gotta just you got you just gotta freaking you gotta rush the enemies down because they they spawn at like a consistent rate and as long as you stay on top of keeping them down then you get to fight them one-on-one -on -one. there we go look at that grabbing the shield enemies was the big brain play right there and this wave that caused this absolute destruction last time we're just absolutely killing right now I've kind of enjoyed this though, like, it makes you strategize a little bit and, uh, like, uh, maximize your strategy for each wave so that you can efficiently make it, efficiently make it through everything. So we're gonna do, uh, let's do this one next. I don't like this one. reasons you could probably oh we're dead oh we're alive <laughs> okay dude i hate these guys so freaking much they're such crap such crap we're doing those first 100% doing those first. I I had a lot of I had some troubles with the lizard men the first time, so I was like, yeah, we'll just get them out of the way. But screw these things, dude. Things are cheap, weak, nasty, trash enemies that can't even kill me themselves. They just got to use their extra little bullshit to take me out, dude. Screw you, little candle nerdlings. Hate you, all my soul. Chug. Shotgun blast. I don't even care. Chug. Shotgun blast. Screw all of you. Get him out of here. Alright, next up. Uh, let's see. I think we only need... Yeah, we should be good with five grabs. Let's do it. Okay. 
Crazy how different like the attempts go. Like one time you just get absolutely owned by something, and the next time you just like near flawlessly absolutely clap it. Just only slightly based on like I don't even know. Like the the fight only went very slightly differently, but the end result was just drastically different. Kind of bizarre how it works sometimes. Oh, come on. Grab this guy, pull him our way, finished. All right, there we go. Man, we can we can like near flawless that that round now. That round is good, good, good. So, let's see here. How many shots do we have? 11. So I'm going to do this one next. This one's kind of spam Lord McGee. So I just want to get it out of the way. As you can see, super effective strat to just use that spam because those guys actually drop us mana as we go. So that is very nice. And so it allows us to replenish our mana as well as uh, sort of be prepared for the next fight. So we just have two melee combat ones next. Um, I'd say the Dino Boys, well, neither one of these are particularly like too difficult, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and drop our health now. And we'll, we'll do the, uh, which, we'll do the, we'll do these guys next. All right, so we have full mana restored, restored here. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll just run with what I'm using here. Uh, cause I'm pretty comfortable fighting these guys. Shouldn't need to use magic on them. Just need to be right on their spawns. Spawn tramp them, camp them, and we'll be good. The shield ones are easy enough. I can block them pretty easily and then uh, just counter attack them, take them down, so. Do, 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 do. Yeah, big boy. Ow, you know what? Shotgun blast to the face. These are the little guys I was thinking about counter blocking. There we go. Bang. Alright. Yeah, that's a that's a baby wave right there. That's a baby wave compared. Let's see. I think what I want to do is I want to do that and then I want to take this off now and swap it for something else. I'm not sure what's worth putting on. So, the full mana, we should be able to... Um, I'm hoping to save the mana for the final fight, for the boss or whatever. Owie. I say that, but that shotgun blast looked way too satisfying not to take. I mean, these guys aren't really hard to do natural combat against. Kind of hit and run tactics. Oh my, wow! That was a big time kablammy blowy right there. So much for saving our mana for the boss. <laughs> you guys like my strat for this guy? <laughs> Just boop, 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 boop. Ah, uh, so this is all we got. We got half health, no mana going into the boss. Oh boy. Bombs equipped. Uh, oh, oh, 
Oh, heal me. Yes. Oh wait, I have healing potions. Is that, wait, so should I, maybe I should go mana potions and use these for healing. I don't know, I'm nervous to, let's, let's just do it. If this is the garden, if this is the garden knight, I should be able to melee this guy. I should be able to melee fight him. To mention that bomb did big damage to him. Oh, no, no, no. Dude, we got so trolled. Oh, oh. Dude, come on, game. That was ass. We were there. We were done. We were literally done. All right, let's fight him first. Dude, he was done. And then he had to hit us with the triple wombo. You gotta be joking me, man. I could have very well just sat back, threw another bomb at him, and finished him too. But like... <sighs> that was some hot trash. Wait, why are there two? What? Wait, what? What? The fuck just happened? Why are there two? Bro. Hello? Is it because I chose to fight the boss first that you make it harder? What, what, what is that? All right, we're going to put the shotgun on and just try and molly -wop him, to be honest. I don't know. I'm just annoyed now after what happened. That was a lot of BS. Yeah, sit down, you clown. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. So let's swap over to our um Maybe it wasn't as easy as I thought, considering it made us fight two of them. I, I would have been real sad if I got through the first guy and the second one spawned and just blapped me, because that absolutely would have happened. Um, well, shucks. This is kind of a bogus situation here. The boss is done. There's no reason. There's no reason for... Oh, God. I'm feeling really unconfident. Man. All right, let's let's eat some of these. Oh, these restore a lot. Okay. So yeah, we'll stick with the ashen potions and let's uh let's see. We should get these guys over with. No, I don't have mana to restore. You know what? Let's fight these guys. Wait. Uh uh okay. these ones we can restore the mana on as we fight them yeah, yeah yeah yeah. there we go so we can top off get free mana off that we basically have full health now okay that was a that was a sick play really sick play so now we need to get through these dum-dums and i think before we do that i want to replenish because i want to have enough shotgun shots to just take them all out i'm not messing around on this crap i want them out and gone
All right, hearts full. We got full flasks. Get our shotgun shots off. All right, let's do it. Don't scuff this. All right, drink. Shotgun shot. Shotgun shot. Goodbye. No questions asked. Take him out. Kill on site. Health up. Mana restore. Uh, so who else do we need mana for? The lizard men we need a little bit of mana for. And potentially the big boys. Okay, let's do uh let's do the lizards. Just to be safe here. Uh, we're gonna put this on. There we go. Okay. Okay. Die. Die lizard man. Okay. Die lizard man. Die, lizard man. You're a big lizard man. Get over here. Die, lizard man. Die, lizard man. Go back. Go to your home, lizard man. Stay at home, lizard man. No fun for you, lizard man. Go away. Go home. This is not your day. Go home. Bye-bye. Okay, shotgun. And we are going to do, uh... <sighs> hmm. Should we do these guys, or...? Yeah, let's do these guys. Alright, come on. Goodbye. Goodbye. As soon as we get the big boy spawn, he's getting shotgunned. Is that big boy spawn? Shotgunned. Alright, finish him. There we go. Get rid of this guy. Shield bro. Alright, block him. Hit him with a combo. He's gone. Shield guy doesn't matter. Spam him as soon as he spawns. He's done. We got a heart. Perfect. We still have a shotgun shot. Okay. Let's go. Do it. Kill on sight. Kill on sight. Get some swings in. Epic shotgun blast. Epic. Epic indeed. Ow. Alright, we need to get our health back here. Alright, swing. Back out. I'm gonna top off. Swing. Back out. Missed. That's fine. The way the big boy walks up in here like he owns the place is unsettling to me. Swing, swing, get out. Oh, he's moving now. Look at him. Look at him go. Oh God. Man, why does this have to come down to the wire, man? Stamina replenish. Oh! They're trying to wombo me. All right, all these, all these little boys got to be low. Big boy is low. This guy is low. Dude, they're all like one shot. <laughs> All right, just keep moving. Swing. Big boy's gone. 
Little boy's gone. Other little boy's gone. Little boys are gone. That's it. Gauntlet completed. Oh. My stress was immeasurable during that. What is that? You feel a tingling. Earn the cathedral's prize. <sighs> I have a tingling in my heart rate right now. Wait, wait. Oh, 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 oh. Guys! It exists. The teleport. The teleport hop exists. Oh. My. Oh my gosh. It exists. It's real. I wasn't going insane. There is a mechanic. To actually move across gaps. Wow. In the very end, it was all worth it. <sighs> all right, what's going on over here? Oh my God, look at the blink. Look at the blink on this guy. Oh. It's amazing. So amazing. Uh, what's back here? Gotta be something. Insane chest. Absolutely insane chest. 25? That's it? Oh, come on. That's some scam right there. I was thinking absolute bangers in mass chest over there. Come. Come on, man. That's it? Really? Hero's Grave, we're here. We can hit these nasty TP jumps now. Give me that upgrade. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, it, it, oh. Wait, this makes our spirit self stronger. Oh. My gosh. Actually, are we restoring like our life through doing this? I don't, this is interesting. Huh. Maybe we, maybe we actually are obligated to go around to these to like restore. Wait, no. Golden. Oh, we can gap it. Look at that. So it begins. Our epic strats are moving around way more efficiently. So you can only do it to other uh, locations that match the height. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I... You can do it up minor, uh, minor gaps though. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Look at us go. We're cracked. Dude, what? This is insane. Dude, there's so much potential to like move around to different spots now. Are you serious? This is too crazy. Way too crazy. Wait, why is there a rope here? What the? Where is this going? Bro, we're already on an excursion. We're already on a bonus excursion over here with this freaking teleportation strats. We found the chest. This leads us out. Oh my god. Oh! Give us that paper. I've wanted you for so long. 
Again, the same battle. Fought uncountable times. Air to the air. So we gotta take down Mommy. Data management, continue game, new game, load game, save data options. So this is, what the? Yeah, what? Literally just giving us info on the... Huh. Interesting. Okay. Beginning your adventure. Do -do. I wonder what that, uh, that gold question mark is. Hmm. All right. Game screen, so we know about all this stuff. All right, this is just standard run of the mill. We obviously just got the one page as you typically do. Uh, so we can teleport ourselves around. Look at us go, this is crazy. This is crazy awesome. It makes me want to explore so much. Wait, this gives me so much potential to move around. You know what? I think we do need to get around to all the heroes' graves to like restore our to restore our life or something. What do you have to say? Nothing. What? I can gap that? That was insane. Gardens. Hello. Alright, is there anything special going on in here? I think there's just a bunch of chests in here in the past, and yeah, it remains the same. Dude, the movement potential with this is insane! Insanely c, c crazy good. Oh, that's, that's sad. Dude, look at all these things we can get! Crazy. All right. Okay. Normal stamina, ghost stamina, and then golden is question marked. I see. I see. Uh, let's see. The hero's grave. We can ascend our ghost self. Uh, wait. Down, right, up, left, up, right. Holy cross. Wait, so we just gotta put in a... We just do a password? Down, right, up, left, up, right. At these doors. And they open? Hold on. Let's test this real quick. Holy cross, yeah. Uh, what was the pattern? Down right, up left, up right. Up left, up right, down right. Down right, up left. So down right, up left, up right. Down right, up left, up right. Dude. 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 This game. Hidden Secrets, Holy Cross, page 49, The Golden Path. Oh, let's go to, where is 49? We don't have page 49. Take your rightful place as heir, heir to the heir. Oh, this is so cool. This feels so good. Like, there's so many things that we can get and stuff to do. Wow. So many secrets hidden in plain sight as well. Cathedral, incredible treasure, heroes, laurels. Yeah, tell me about it. Got them right on my head. Whoops. Not to mention this teleporting would be OP in a combat, I feel. All right, uh, I want to teleport across here. 
Let's see what's going on with this thing. Because this thing didn't make any sense in the normal world. Maybe it's got some like cool stuff going on with it here. The, the, the thing to slow down time has to do with this. It's got to. Maybe I just had to hold it longer because in the past I did it and it um it like it made the music sound normal but uh not in it didn't like stick if that makes sense it like eventually wore off dude we can move around so quick all right we're gonna rest here um and we're gonna let me put my normal flasks back on. So let's swap over to uh, let's just do this movement speed. The hearts thing has kind of proved it, its worth to me. And we're doing great. We got a thousand here. Oh wait. All right. We'll do uh we'll do one last thing. Here. So let's go down here. Can I jump across right there? I can't. We can jump across right here. Bang. All right, windmill. Let's go to the shop, because we have a thousand, which means one thing. All right, seek the golden path. Wait, is that golden path thing below us? Is that what that is? One. Hello, hello, my good merchant. We're back. We are ready to buy this. Yes, give me debt. Give me damn baby. So we just got a bunch of consumables here now. Which technically we don't need to worry about. So that is wonderful. Oh, there's so much. There's so much. There is so gosh darn diddly much to do now. Oh, I'm like, oh, I feel so rejuvenated after that though. I was going, going through that graveyard area and then getting down there and going through the gauntlet was an experience, but we made it in the end. And I feel absolutely wonderful right now. I feel so accomplished and like at ease and at peace right now. And I'm ready to like chillax hopefully for the next couple of episodes and go around and just uncover some secrets and stuff. Yeah. But uh, as, I, as uh, I was saying, that's going to be a wrap for this episode, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure to leave a like on the video and uh, be sure to subscribe to the channel so you can receive live notifications for when brand new videos are released. Uh, but that's all for now, folks. So thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you guys in the next one.